How's it going everyone? My name is Potato and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. Today we're going to be going over, covering, talking about, and showing off a pretty cool throwback easter egg or a flashback Friday uh, easter egg that is in GTA 5 and GTA Online and uh, I'm not going to lie, I, I just recently found out about this to be honest and it's an older easter egg. It was actually found last year around this time I believe or a little bit earlier even when the game first came out but it's just come to my attention and I thought it was really interesting so I wanted to kind of revisit it for some of you guys who may not or may also have not known about this uh, cool little easter egg inside of the game so what you want to do is you want to go to downtown Los Santos there's a comic store there and it's got a really cool little front to it just a, a entrance I guess you could say and the windows there's cool decals and stickers of uh, things that we see throughout the game and in-game advertisements uh, pictures, posters, shirts, etc. And it's really cool. And I, I never even knew this building was there because there's another comic store actually on the uh, Vinewood Bo Boulevard, I, I believe it is. But this one is just a couple blocks away from that. And like I said, I didn't know it was there. But if you actually look up when you're in front of this comic store, there is actually a superhero or a supervillain uh, on a balcony uh, that's uh, on top of the store essentially. And it's the brown streak superhero and I thought this was really freaking cool because like I said I never noticed this before one I didn't notice the comic store was there and I always go to the barber shop that's right next door to it and also I didn't know that this this model uh, of the of the brown streak was there too so uh, I thought that was really cool now if you guys aren't really familiar with the superheroes in GTA 5 the brown streak is of course one I'm not really sure if he's a supervillain or a superhero but there's also the Impotent Rage who also appears in the GTA 5 campaign in front of the comic store that's on, uh, or in the Vinewood Boulevard. And you can talk to this guy, he's just a, a little stranger that you can come across. So, uh, just really cool. I, I thought this was really interesting, as I said, because I, I didn't know it was there. Some of you guys may have known this was there since the beginning. You don't gotta let us know down in the comments because we don't care. And also, even if you didn't know this, that's, like I said, it's just awesome that this is there. So... If you guys did enjoy this short little Flashback Friday episode and would like to see more videos like this, be sure to leave a like, of course, and subscribe if you are new around here. That way you never miss out on an upload. And with all that said and out of the way, I believe that's just about it. You guys all take it easy, have a safe one, and I will talk to you later. Bye.